Hey everyone, how's it going? So this is a huge slap in the face and a great insight into how the hell Nexon works. And I just want to make a very brief video about it. I'm not even going to edit any of this or anything. So after investigating the cube and rebirth flame thing, they realized that it didn't align with their development goals. Congratulations, I could have told you that the moment that you posted the patch notes. But anyway, uh, they discovered there was an error, sure. However, such review requires additional time for us to thoroughly calculate the drop rate after reviewing players' levels and the number of elite mobs that players defeated. So, what they're telling me is that the only way that they can calculate the drop rate for something is to do the exact same way that players do. They look at the number of mobs that people defeated and how many items they got and that's how they calculate drop rate. I thought drop rate wasn't a, a variable that you put into your game that would decide these things, but no. <laughs> I guess they can't look at their own code to realize how things work. But on top of all of this, the only things that they're going to roll back are you're no longer going to get cubes and flames from elite monsters, and you're going to get golden hammers again. What about boss flames? What about boss cubes? You nerfed those things and you didn't even give that back. I I am I am so done with this. I I I I can't anymore. It's I still stand by my last video. <laughs> I it, this is just unbelievable to me. But yeah. Um thanks uh thanks for watching and uh good luck with Maple. <laughs> You're going to need it.